Apple's iPhone 14, rumored to arrive sometime between September and October of this year, might include a significant new model, the iPhone 14 Max. A newly discovered image of four aluminum blocks milled into the design of four potential iPhone 14 models has experts guessing at iPhone 14 models. So guys, before we begin our today's video, please tell me from which country are you guys watching our today's video from? We love reading your comments. These rough honed slabs aren't much to look at, though the iconic iPhone design is unmistakable. Aside from what appears to be two very prominent camera modules on the 6.7 inch iPhone 14 Pro Max and 6.1 inch iPhone 14 Pro models, there's a notable addition, suggests Apple Insider, which spotted a leak post by Quick Review Lab on the Chinese social media platform Weibo. Instead of a 5.4 inch iPhone 14 mini model on one end, there's a new 6.7 inch model, the iPhone 14 Max. It's notable not only for being the same size as the iPhone 14 Pro Max, but for sharing a two camera module system with the iPhone 14. And we've been hearing about it for a few months now. Granted, we're living in the gap between the Apple iPhone 13 in our hands and the iPhone 14 we expect, filling it with rumors powered by apparent design and manufacturing leaks. In other words, we should take these rumors with a big grain of salt. Still, the possible existence of a big screen iPhone 14 Max could mean an interesting new option for budget conscious iPhone fans. After all, iPhone has now shown a propensity for spreading its best screen and top tier CPU across all its iPhone models and using things like the camera array, storage and memory to adjust pricing. A 6.7 inch iPhone 14 Max could price wise fall in between the iPhone 14 and 14 Pro while still offering with the big screen a bit of what you could get at the top end of the line. But what made Apple to add a bigger variant in the iPhone 14 lineup? Ask consumers and you'll hear a consistent story. They like their phones big. The flagship standard across the iPhones and Androids are devices 6.5 inches in size or larger. The problem with big screen phones is they usually carry an equally big price. An iPhone 14 Max could be just what your wallet ordered, especially if Apple doesn't skimp in other areas. So isn't it a good plan? It would be a shame though if the addition of this larger entry level device means the end of the iPhone 14 mini. Apple's laudable mini line is the last iPhone to respect those with small hands and maybe equally small screen aspirations. So guys, what do you think about the new upcoming variant in the lineup? Let us know in the comment section below. And if you liked our today's video, then do smash the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our Gadgets friendly channel, Gadgets Times.